Hi you cheeky scrub lords. This is just another one of those slip phantom ripoffs. I suppose I can review the Stalin cannon. The KV-2. You play the KV-2 to punish dissidents and to please all of our communistic forefathers. Stalin, Marx, Engels and Lenin. Make communism great again. And feast on capitalistic tears. You do not select the 107mm gun. Because that is used for KV-5 scrubs. If you choose the 107 you suck. There is only one correct gun 152mm packages of pure communism. You select mostly AG to break people's hope of freedom. And some AP to pretend you will ever fire those shells. You do not select skill rounds because you don't want to sponsor wargaming capitalism. The KV-2 is slower than Mother Teresa and therefore cannot sickably add rush B. You choose your flank wisely and go out there. You wait for your enemies to make mistakes. You fire AG at their weak spots, so all dissidents inside the vehicle will die. When reloading you can do the sicker dance. As soon as your sights are embracing the target, fire, you will hit. The reload is measured in calendar days, so you cannot waste random shots. The KV-2 also does not care about matchmaking as it is the strongest tank in the game. This is how you set up your crew. Select repairs. When you have reached your first skill, retrain for 6th sense. Select nice to have skills on the rest of your crew. When you've reached your second skill, drop for brothers in arms. After that select anything that pleases our comrades. In order to improve the performance of your armorless social apartment building on tracks, select the following equipment. Gun lane drive, rammer, and vents. You can fire on the move when at close range, but you must be fucking stupid to engage multiple targets at the same time. Therefore you round up the KV-2 along with your communistic brothers, and play a 3 KV-2 platoon like a true wannabe unicorn. Sometimes even sniping is a suitable option, because Stalin overrules the RNG, and armor and tears are nothing more but numbers. Simply put KV-2 gives zero shits. Now you know how to make communism work not only in theory, but also in practice. Go out there, and make communism great again. I hope you have liked this puny attempt in making a guide. Feel free to like, subscribe and leave your feedback below. Thank you now fuck off.